We're staying at Valentine's, which we've stayed at many times, and this is the building that we're staying in. We stayed in this building two years ago when we came, and we went up through those stairs, but now we're staying here. I think I'm gonna go to the pool. Welcome to the Bahamas vlog. We made it early morning wake-up call. We woke up around 3.30 and had a 7 a.m. flight to Fort Lauderdale and then Fort Lauderdale to North Eleuthera. And then you take a water taxi to Harbor Island, which is one of our favorite places in the whole wide world. If you are new here, I spent many, many summers here growing up. And when my mom passed, we actually spread her ashes here years ago. So it's a very special, special place to us. And every time we come, it just brings back all the memories of of my childhood. I just like to think of this place as a second home. It just is everything and more. It's the most amazing place. So we just got here. We're spending four nights here, five days. We leave Sunday. It is currently Wednesday and I'm so excited to vlog. I wanted to start off the vlog with a room tour. We usually stay at Valentine's. When I vlogged two years ago when we came and I brought Christian for the first time, I don't think I filmed a room tour of Valentine's. So I'm gonna do a room tour to start off the vlog and this is where we have stayed many, many times. We've also stayed in homes at the marina all over, but I feel really excited, really lucky to be here, and I'm so excited to be vlogging. So let's start off with a tour. Okay, so all of our stuff is kind of everywhere, but you walk in through this door. When we were first coming up, I kind of shared where we've stayed before in the past. We've never stayed in this specific building at Valentine's, but you walk in through here, and then there's the king suite, which is where my dad is staying. And then the bathroom. And then there's a full length mirror, which I love. And here is the kitchen, living room. And there's a pull out sofa in the living room. And then a back porch. Can't wait to have morning coffee out here. It's so stunning. And then there's the pool area over there and then over on the other side of these trees and the wall is the marina where we came in and then on the other side of the island is the beach this is the bay side and i love it here okay so up the stairs is where we're all staying which is where everyone is and here <laughs> two beds up here and then Bathroom. I came downstairs to share what I was wearing today. I have a bikini on underneath this, which I'll share. But I'm wearing this tank top that I have tucked up into my bikini. It's a waffle material. It's from The Perfect Tea. And this is what I wore today. I can link it. I took a couple photos in it when we went to lunch. And I think it's so cute. And it also comes in so many different patterns, colors, and I think different materials as well. Okay, just changed for dinner. I'm wearing this yellow dress from Free People. I don't know if you can see that, but it has a really low back. It has pockets too, and it comes in a ton of colors. I just love the yellow. And I would take your normal size in this, unless you're taller. In my opinion, it runs big on me, but I feel like a lot of Free People stuff runs big, and it's a little bit longer. And then for shoes, I'm wearing my Tiki's. But this is the fit. We're going to get drinks at the Dunmore Hotel and then have dinner, like a casual dinner, here at the marina bar and lounge area. So everything will be linked to that I'm wearing on the trip down below.
this angle is straight. It's the next morning. I feel like I haven't really vlogged a lot while we're here, but we're in Harbor Island for a couple of days. I'm so excited to be here. It's seriously my favorite place in the whole entire world. And I'm just so happy to be here. But it's the next day. We're gonna do a beach day today because we have really good weather today and we just can't guarantee that tomorrow and Saturday are good weather days. Sunday we are leaving. We have a morning flight and then we land back in Orlando around like 12:30. I can't remember if I shared where we're staying, but we're staying at Valentine's, which is where we usually stay. It's a great accommodation spot um, if you're ever interested in coming to Harbor Island. There are of course boutique hotels, but it can get very pricey, but there's so many good restaurants, bars, the views are insane. Just every place is gorgeous here. The sand is pink. It, it's just the best best place um ever so i'm so excited to be vlogging so excited to be bringing you all along on another travel vlog here in harbor island but just wanted to talk to the camera i know it's been a minute yesterday was crazy we woke up early traveled i woke up at like 3 45 and we left at like 4 30 to go to the airport and we had a layover in Fort Lauderdale and we landed at like 11:30 here and our room wasn't ready so we went we changed in like the bathroom at the marina into a bathing suit and we went to lunch at the blue bar which is one of our favorite places and they kind of updated it a little bit since two years ago so it's just nice to see the changes that they've made and how they've updated certain parts of the island and we're gonna go to some of our favorite spots throughout the trip some of our favorite dinner spots we already went to the Dunmore yesterday which is just a beautiful hotel it's so stunning and we're gonna do probably a nicer dinner tonight at Rock House which is another favorite so um, and if you're new here um, I think I mentioned this but this is a place where I used to spend a lot of summers and I'm very lucky to have had that growing up. It's such a blessing. It was my mom's favorite place. And when she passed, this place felt only right to spread her ashes here. So that's what we did. And I just feel closer to her when I'm here. And I feel like she's just all around. It's just crazy. And I'm sure a lot of you do have places too that are really special that you've spent a lot of time maybe as a child and being an adult and going back to those places, you just realize how lucky you are to have places like this that are so beautiful and that just feel like coming home and coming back to and my mom's ashes are here so I just feel so close to her here because we spent so much time with her here throughout my childhood. So yeah. Anyways, I just wanted to pick up the camera and let you know what's going on kind of formally, I guess, introduce the vlog, but um, yeah. So beach day today, happy hour, dinner, I'm so excited. And breakfast is done, so I'm gonna head downstairs, eat, and I'll share my outfit before we leave. Outfit of the day for the beach. My bathing suit is from Hunza G, and my set or cover up is from LC, I believe that's how you say it. I'm wearing Javiana flip flops. And then this beach bag is old from Zara last year. My hat is lack of color. And then I have a little MEJ clip on it. And I don't really have much in here, just sunglasses, some sunscreen, a hair tie, and my phone. No, Aaron. So 
what's your name? Six, seven. I got a skinny margarita. Christian got an espresso martini. Aaron got a That is my second choice. You just such a big guy. Michael. We're outside at the bar. Six, six. At Rock House. All right. It's two. Does anyone want to rate my cannonball? Rate it? Yeah, yeah, sure. Let's see it. Okay, cannonball. Okay. Really? Yeah. Go ahead. Jet skis anywhere? Oh. Mm -hmm. Only right there. That's, oh. that's what I'm assuming, right? Just changed for a casual dinner. We spent the whole afternoon at the pool because the weather was pretty nice. Wearing this tank top from Brandy Melville. These pants are from Park, some Raffia platform sandals. This bag is Rebecca Minkoff, and then my jewelry is basically all Lily Clasp. And then I didn't really style my hair at all. Just natural, I kind of gave up. It's like at that point in the trip where you just don't want to spend a lot of time doing your hair because you're in the golf cart. It's so humid outside, every time I walk outside, I mean my hair just instantly falls. So gave up and just didn't style it for dinner tonight. But Pretty good weather. We thought it was gonna rain today and tonight, but it just sprinkled for, or actually it poured for probably like 15 minutes and then it cleared up. So we're crossing our fingers that it stays nice because we are eating outside for dinner. So we're going to Remora Bay. And yeah, this is the comfy fit. I remember this place now. Yeah? Down over that way. Yeah. You know, we can do at the 
spending it at the beach get some sun we got very lucky with weather i think i mentioned it in the beginning of this vlog that we thought that a tropical wave which turned into a tropical storm was gonna head this way and it ended up going into the gulf instead of on the east coast of florida so we got really lucky and really lucky with weather so excited to get some sun and then maybe we'll grab some lunch later Hopefully I leave with some sort of tan. I don't tan easily at all. So we're hoping. Wait, wait, hold on. I don't know if you can see it. 